take a mundane task and turn it into something fun and enjoyable. Usually yard work is a task that we don't really want to do. <laughs> it always takes a long time and I feel like it's always overwhelming starting yard work. Because there's always so much to get done and you just want to get it done in one shot and then it ends up being like four hours or five hours. <laughs> but we just enjoyed being outside and enjoying our time together. It was honestly a lot and I'm exhausted, <laughs> so I'm excited to journal a bit and then end the day with some meditation. The wedding yesterday was really fun. I got to meet some new people and build some connections, but I also don't think I want to get into the photography world. I didn't write anything substantial. I feel like I'm just drowning my own self-pity today. I just want to know what's next for me. I want to have clarity and I'm losing patience. Do I keep making these? Do I keep vlogging? Do I close the camera and never open it again? Do I find another corporate job just to shut my brain up and make some money? Like, of anything, there is a loud voice in my head saying, do not just take another pointless corporate job to make money right now. And I can't sell myself short just to fill that void and to be able to tell people that I got a job and I'm making money. The future belongs to those who believe in the beauty of their dreams. Same. I got this pillow to sit on, but I'm so tired and it looks so inviting, so I'm just gonna lay down. I'm just gonna try to relax my whole body and dive into a deep, deep meditation. feel like my whole body just sunk into the yoga mat and it didn't even feel like I was laying on the hard deck. It was kind of like, I felt like I was on a nice bed, a nice comfortable mattress. So it was just kind of relaxing my body and listening to my breath and letting my thoughts travel wherever they wanted. I was very content where I was. It was really nice and I think I really needed that. I think the most important thing that I've learned from making these videos and from doing this practice several days in a row is you really don't know what you need until you start listening to your body and Stop listening to all the external factors around you telling you what's best for yourself. There's so much information out there nowadays that is the best remedies for this or you must do these five things to be healthy or eat this and you'll never be tired again but it's just not true. It might be true for them, it might be true for some people but Living a healthy lifestyle is mostly just listening to your body and listening to what it needs. And if it needs to 
lay down on the deck looking up at the clouds for 10 minutes instead of doing anything else, then that's what you should do. But You're also never gonna know until you sit still and really listen. It takes a lot of patience and it takes a lot of trial and error and nobody's gonna be perfect at it either. But I think once you start listening, you're gonna learn a lot more about yourself than you ever thought you would.